So I'll be showing you how to install and enable the Google Keyboard or Gboard if you like on the Samsung Galaxy A23. So to install the keyboard, the first thing you need to do is go into the Google Play Store, tap on that. And in the Google Play Store, just do a quick search of Gboard, okay? Just search for Gboard as you can see. And here is the Google Keyboard, also called Gboard. So go ahead and install that. Once the installation finishes, simply tap on open to launch Gboard and then select enable in settings. And that should take you to the keyboard selection settings page. So under default keyboard, you can tap on that and you should see, you should see the Gboard, but because we've not enabled it like this by tapping on that, and tapping OK, and now that it's enabled, we can actually select it from the list of default keyboards. So tap on that. And now we can see the default keyboard is Gboard. So now you can also, once again, go into settings and then go back to uh, general management and then go to keyboard settings or keyboard list and default, tap on that. And you should see the option to change your default keyboard. If you tap on Gboard, it takes you inside the Gboard settings where you can change the language, uh, some preferences like uh, one handed mode, keyboard height, stuff like that. Uh, you can uh, customize voice typing. You can even change the theme by tapping on theme and selecting different themes for the Google keyboard. All right. So you can select from any of these themes that you can use as a background of your keyboard. But now since we have the Gboard or the Google keyboard as our default keyboard, anytime you go into a messaging service and try to type a new message or anything, you're going to be using the Google keyboard, All right? Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below. If you found this video useful, make sure to leave a like and I'll talk to you guys in the next one.